Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So I have a Christmas box unboxing for you today. This is a mystery box from Cougar and it is the Christmas mystery box. This is supposed to be a mix of brands, so it's not all just Cougar products. They said it's got a sort of mainstream brands as well. I'm expecting things like Rimmel, Maybelline, that type of thing. Um, it is a mystery. I don't know what's inside. It did cost $29.99. So I'm hoping that I haven't just wasted £30 on things that I don't want or need. I'm hoping there's lots of um, good bargains in here. But yeah, it's come in this really nice box and it's all sort of tied up with ribbon. So it'd be great for a gift. The only thing is, if you're giving it as a gift, I think I'd kind of want to know what's inside. So you'd have to open it and see what's inside before you gift it I would think but maybe that's just me I don't really like to gift surprises to people <laughs> it's all right to surprise them but not surprise the person that's giving them in my opinion so anyway I've took the ribbon off let's have a look inside and see what we've got hmm I'm already underwhelmed uh, it doesn't look like there's a lot of products in here And from first glance, there's nothing from other brands. It said there was stuff from other brands. Oh, there is, but not much. Anyway, let's just crack on and see what we've got. So this is the first product. You know my feelings on these. It's not a luxury, it's not a gift, and it's not massive either. I will use this, but mm, it's not really something that I think, oh, happy Christmas, you've got a shower puff. <laughs> Anyway, I'm very negative today. I don't know why, so apologies. I'll try not to be. Um, so next, we have a Cougar product, and this is a Bee Venom face mask. It just looks like that. And it doesn't really say what it does. Um, usually, when you've got products, it would tell you what it does. It just says to apply thoroughly to cleanse skin, avoiding the eye area, leave for five minutes, rinse with warm water, use once or twice a week. It doesn't say on it um, that this is a product, um, you know, for moisturising or for cleansing or what it's for. So your guess is as good as mine on that one. Next, we have a moisturizer which is a rubos tea moisturizer um, so this is designed to shield your skin against pollution and that's all it says oh it's got snail secretion in it i'm not i'm not keen on products that have snail stuff in them and it's not because i have anything against it as a product as in i've no idea if it does work well or not i just don't like the thought of having snail slime on me but that's just me um we then got a five in one foundation which i think is a terrible thing to put in a beauty box because like how many different shades are there in foundation in in life normally how would you know that this would suit me? It definitely doesn't as well. Um, it's too dark. But this is a powder foundation. So, mm, not impressed with that. We've got a body lotion, which is a really big body lotion. So, that's a good size. Again, this is Cougar. And this is the gold infused argan oil body lotion. Let's give this one a sniff. It doesn't seem to have any smell to it. Oh, I've got it on my nose. Yeah, it's got no smell to it. So, I mean, it might be a good body lotion, but stuff like body lotion, I quite like to have a nice scent, and that doesn't have one. So, mm. I'm a bit mm, about that one product as well. Um, we've got a Cougar five shades of nude i think this is an eyeshadow palette it's quite a pretty palette so that's it there those are quite pretty colors so i suppose that one's okay just remember though that this cost me 30 pounds 
And then we've got this Cougar brush, which isn't soft. There's hairs coming off it. Yeah. Look at all the hairs. Can you see the hairs in the box there? <laughs> They've all just come off this um, very hard kabuki brush. So, next we have another Cougar product, which is a red liquid lipstick. So much for the, um, this is going to have other brands in it. So it looks like this, it's just a red lipstick. So we've got the final product, which is the one product that is not Cougar. And this is a collection lip balm. So to say that this has got lots of leading brands in it, and then to put one lip balm in it, and the rest of it is Cougar products, is very misleading. This box, the amount of stuff in this box is similar to the £10 mystery boxes and this was charged at £30 so I was expecting something a lot more for my money. I am very, very disappointed if I'm honest and I know that I never come across as negative on my channel and that is not because I tell fibs or um, because I... Um, think everything's wonderful obviously I don't because I don't think this is wonderful I literally tell you the, tell you the honest truth and when I love stuff I love a lot of stuff but when I do love stuff I love it and don't waste your money this is awful I'm I'm not normally this negative but that is just you know this is my opinion and this is what I think and Honestly, I have had £10 mystery boxes in the past with similar quality or calibre of products. So to add an extra £20 to it and call it a Christmas mystery box is absolutely ridiculous. To say there's um, other brands in here and then to put one lip balm in here is absolutely ridiculous. I was excited because I was hoping for, you know, products like Rimmel or Maybelline or things like that. I got a collection lip balm and the rest of the stuff is Cougar products. Now, if if it had been an all Cougar product, product box, I wouldn't have bought it because I've had mystery boxes from them before and I don't need any more sort of Cougar products really. I've got quite a few waiting to be used. Not to say that Cougar have bad products or anything like that just that i didn't really need another cougar mystery box if that makes sense so the fact that it had other brands in it i thought oh yeah let's give this a try and see what's inside and yeah i'm very very disappointed so apologies for <laughs> being so negative but you know you've got to be honest haven't you um so yeah i will link in the description this box should you want to pick one up which um Maybe the products that were in this box are things that you really love and you do want to pick it up, so I will link it down below just in case. But for me, it's a definite no, and I wish I hadn't wasted my money, if I'm honest. But there you go. I hope you did enjoy this honest review. <laughs> and um, I hope to see you in a video again soon. Bye for now.